it's much faster. What are you doing? Yeah. Twenty five hundred vision. <laughs> yeah, I was there. LASIK. I had LASIK. I had twenty oh, over really? six hundred, yeah. It's a little traumatic, but all right, now I'm gonna go out of this. Did you want to capture some video of that? Oh, Sam? do you want video of the um, yeah. um, okay. sure. asteroids? You want the asteroid game. Okay. If you want to just game? do that real like maybe ten seconds. Okay. <laughs> They were much easier on me than this time. I think it's because the Earth is really far away. <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I just don't see this for games. I'm sorry, but my eyes would be like completely wasted. <laughs> well, for games like first person shooters to like turn and like look around, I think be it would cool. be pretty good. Oh, you people do it for what? games already. It's just not, you know. Okay, so you got, uh, do you want any more pictures from here? Just, I mean, whatever. You want me to do whatever? Yeah. Okay. Whatever, yeah. What kind of music do we want to hear? <laughs> uh, looking at Elvis, looking back up. Looking down at the Beatles, looking back up. If you look at the image longer, it grows. Then you go down. Um, okay. This is them scrolling. These are types of things like this, it's just set at a certain rate. Those are the kind of functionality where it would be whatever you wanted it to be in that case. And this one. Know, I'm going to look at the red thing here. We've set these up so that there are different rates of zoom. So I zoom at, I think, 50%, then greater. So you and look where you want to get the zoom. And all I'm doing is, yeah, yeah, I'm looking at that red, mm -hmm. and then I hit one of the buttons to zoom to different degrees, and then I hit I to go back. So let's say I want to look back again at that red, that red button. I'll press the, I'll look at it, and then it's going, to zoom in on that spot, and then if I want to pan the entire image, I just set it up here so that I have a tab, and I look from, I'm looking over to the left, and the image then moves as I uh, look around to the left. If I look up to the top, the image moves on my behalf. So these are all the speed, the zoom, all those types of things are just things that you would manage in the software. But the capability is, they know exactly where you're looking, and so whatever you've programmed it to do based on where you're looking, it can do on demand. And then the last game, also fun. This is just illustrating a blurry screen, and then the clarity is really sort of in an area around my vision. And the way vision works is such that um, you actually have clarity in your vision in an area at arm's length about the size of your thumb. And this is just really to illustrate that the computer knows so every time I look, it gets clear. And the M's then you get to select them by glancing at them. I think it's set for maybe one or two seconds. And then this, of course, is eyes moving back and forth. Okay? Okay.